through the um, ASMR YouTube channel. Now, in today's video, we have got not one but two football kits to unbox. For you. Well, to unbag really, but unbox for you guys today. One of them is one that I'm pretty sure you're aware that I was going to get. The other one is going to be another mystery kit because I love getting a monthly mystery kit. I budget out of my wages the chance to sort of get some and obviously I had a little bit left over for my birthday money to get me the football kit so the first one actually came from ASOS because it turns out it's cheaper to get it from ASOS than the club website and once again going with the absolute goat mystery kit goat guys know already that there needs to be no more introductions to this company. Absolutely fantastic, absolutely fantastic customer service. I ordered this Wednesday night, I got it Friday. What more can I want? So I think what we'll do is open the normal kit first. Comes with a little grab handle. Very excited for this because I adore the look of this kit. The first time I've ever thought that a away kit could look better than the home kit. Like little, oh, it comes with a packet. We have a nice CEO 15% vitamin C brightening serum. I'm actually going to use that. Fuck it, why not? The gold standard of vitamin C to rapidly brighten the appearance of skin and boost vital skin pounds. You know what? I'm going to, I'm assuming it goes on your face. By morning and night as needed. Oh, we sure you only sent me a sachet, haven't you? It's going on my hands and it's going on my. I mean, it's a nice colour. It smells okay. Oh, it smells like citrus, which I expect it's vitamin C, isn't it? on my arms oh my god I bet you didn't didn't expect to get this in a kit unboxing did you it's not sticky it's a little bit oily but I suppose it's a serum it's meant to be isn't it and I already look redder there we go look at that Look at that. Bosh. Anyway. To match the kit. Oh my god. Look at that. Now it's the most satisfying and unsatisfying thing ever. The kit badge goes in the whole of the A. That is fantastic. I think that's really sexy. But they've put a sticker over it. Pain in their arses. It says, hey God, hey, guess what? I'm made from 90% recycled materials. And better still, I'm recyclable. This bag is not a toy. For some people. Oh, there's a lot of static on this kit. Well, here we go. Oh, that's so nice. It is so nice. No name on the bag because I'm not tempting fate this year. You guys know the past couple of years I've put names on my kit and it's always gone balls wrong. So we have. Like the home kit. A nice iridescent badge. I must admit, I really hope we go back to the normal badge because the pink and blue just doesn't do it for me. There's something wrong with doing, doing the badge wrong. Like our badge is 
gold and blue and white and black. Not orange and blue. Please just go back. However, yes, the orange and blue is nice. We will try it on in a few moments' time. But we do officially have a look at the collar. The collar's lovely on this. The collar's lovely. It folds over. Look at that. Arm cuffs. Nice. Looks very nice indeed. Again, engineered. Proper night kit. London, Chelsea. In a medium. Can't go. Ability wrong. I was very excited to get that kit, but even more excited to get, yet again, another mystery kit. And we will try both of them on as well, so these are a little bit harder to get into. I always have to cut them. conscious that I'm going to accidentally cut through the shirt so I have to cut like really close to the top which then of course helps more some now I've seen the colour and I have no idea I'm going to wait a second I'm going to wait to put it out but again this out in a minute. I'm buzzing. <laughs> Look at that and the material is fantastic. This is the Atletico Madrid 1920 third kit. But that is absolutely gorgeous. And it's the Vaping It player spec. Gold badge. Where does it say on here? It, it doesn't say on there at all. But, oh, there we go. Nike. You probably can't see that. Nike Vaping It. What does it say? Nike vaping it, yeah. Wow. Wow. That might be my favourite kit I've got so far. I'm not joking. This and the Club America one are outrageously good. Outrageously nice. So we're going to give this a bit of a read. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even see that at the top. It's put hashtag Zhao Felix vibes. And as you guys know, Joe Felix is not long signed for Chelsea. Which I'm very happy about. I love him. I think he's class. It says, Hi Luke. Thanks as always for the repeat custom. I hope you're on the mend after your recent surgery. You now watch the channel. I love it. I have upgraded your shirt from a standard to a premium kit. You didn't have to do that, but thank you very much. As a little pick-me-up. Atletico Madrid... 1920 vape in it, the third kit, player spec. Again, these people treat you very well. And again, I'd like to say it's not just because I've got a channel and I do this, but again, he watches the channel. But if you guys ever want to just go there, like, I don't get paid by them. I don't, you know. I don't do deals with them on a daily basis where I go, yeah, keep up, yeah, keep up. I don't. I just, I just don't. Because, again, I've always done. Like I don't do much sponsored content. I don't do any, if I'm being totally honest. Bar the coin sponsor last year, which I wasn't too happy about, but I did it for the back. Um, but yeah. When it comes to that sort of stuff, I will. I know there's certain people that won't go for certain things because they don't want to be associated with it, and I understand that. But I take the opposite approach. I go for 
if anyone emails me and says, look, do you want to do a sponsor video? Which, again, I don't get. There's been three or four occasions in the past. I will always speak to them at the very least and say, look, if it is good, I will say it's good. And if it is bad, I'll say it's bad. Now, that in the past has made a few things not go to plan. And a few people have gone, no, sorry. And I've gone, ah, fair enough. If you won't let me be honest about anything, I won't do it. These don't even sponsor me. So it means anything I say will always be genuine anyway, regardless of whether it's sponsored or not. Okay. These don't sponsor me. And I still rate it. Please, 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 please go and check them out. Again, it's one of those things where there are many, many a company out there, your sports directs and your Adidas and your Nikes, and people will buy off them all the time. They're established companies. This it's not this is just a guy with a shop in I'm not gonna say Dublin. Dungannon. It is in Ireland. It is in Ireland. I know that for a fact. I asked him, I said, I'm going to go visit his shop one day. And uh, I messaged him because I thought it was in England. <laughs> and he was like, it's in Ireland. I went, yeah, maybe not. Uh, unless I'm over in Ireland, which is a possibility. I've got family over there. So if we ever go visit them, then I'm tempted. I might go and see him. But yeah, it is one of those things. But I mean, look at the quality of kit for a start. This It's weird, isn't it, that I actually got more excited about the Athletic Madrid kit than the Chelsea kit, but we are going to try them both on, so bear with me two seconds. I'll give you a bit of a rundown on how the kits look. Okay, so the first Chelsea kit. Love it. Look at this. I really like this kit. I am a big, big fan of this kit. The orange stripe, the blue and the orange and the sort of off-white. It is almost like a, like a, it's like a pink cream. I don't know what you'd call it. It has got a hint of pink to it. But it is such a smart kit. Come on! And actually, Chelsea playing tomorrow at half past 12 against West Ham. Now, I've seen Chelsea playing this kit a couple of times. I'm hoping we play in the home kit tomorrow. Are we, are we home or away against uh, West Ham? Uh, we're away, so we're probably playing in this kit. So it probably come at the right time, unless we're playing in the third kit, which I'm still debating. I might get it in the sale next year. The colour is lovely. The colour is really nice. Sleeves, again, are cuffed a bit better than the home kit, I'd say. Love it. And I've got marks on my hat. Wait, there it is. Where I've had my short, uh, my long sleeve top rubbed up. Look at this. Anyway, moving on to the Athletic Madrid kit. I'm actually really buzzing, and I feel like it's going to be one of the nicest feeling kits I've ever, ever, ever. Immediately off the rip, off the rip, this is a tight kit. It is like tailor fit, this. Arms, not so much. I just happened, by the way, so I've done a bit of tidying up in this room. It's been a bit of a mess the past couple of weeks, and now I'm sort of getting back on my feet a little bit. I thought it was time to give it a bit of a tidy. And I found these shorts, and I thought, it's quite warm up here, you know, I'm moving about quite a bit, I put the shorts on. What are the odds? Like, I, I would never wear shorts like this, unless I'm golfing, and today I just felt like wearing them. What are the odds? What are the odds I wear this, and then get a kit the same colour? Why does my bum look massive? My bum is massive. Um, not usually a fan of this collar, right? I, I must admit, the actual kit itself, the design of the collar, I'm not a fan of. However, however, wearing it, it is really comfortable. And I don't know if you guys can see this. But it actually says, where is it, Athleti, in the kit. That's really good design. Again, I must have reviewed this back when I did the uh, kit reviews for the La Liga 
2019 to 20. That one looks wham. <laughs> well, I suppose I'm still swollen a little bit from the surgery, especially on that side. I don't know why this side's big. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Um, I very much enjoyed this. This has been fantastic. Look at this. What a kit. What a kit. I love it. I think it's my favourite. Might genuinely be the most favourite kit I've got. I've got, in fact, no, actually, my Deschamps. Is it Deschamps? Yeah. This kit's still my favourite. Big up authentic 1980s. I think. Where's the video? 99 to 01. Unreal. But yeah, this is my favourite mystery kit that I've got it, it's so thin it's so like actually breathable I suppose vaping it makes sense it's a bit weird I wonder if they've stuck with this vaping it for like player issue shirts because you know the Chelsea one I've just got the standard Chelsea shirt because I'm not paying an extra 30 odd quid for, for vaping it I'm just not doing it especially when it's just like part of the collection but I wonder if they've stuck with this because this feels fantastic and it really is slimming other than the arse. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you later. Goodbye.